So I feel like Ravenclaw would have glasses, but you can kind of see my light and it's a little distracting. So, hey guys, so in the spirit of Halloween and all things magic, I wanted to try the Harry Potter collection by Ulta, which came out earlier this summer. Um, in no particular order, I want to start with Ravenclaw. So they are known for their wisdom, intellect, and wit. I think that I have Ravenclaw in me, but I'll tell you what house I am at the end of the series. Um, their house colors are bronze and blue, so you're going to see this look is going to be using a lot of those colors. The palette retails for $16, and I'm looking forward to trying it. I'm going to also be using the Deathly Howls, Howls brushes. I don't know why I can't say that right now. Um, Hallows brushes, um, and so we're going to be using, using those and the Harry Potter 9 and 3 quarters lip gloss. Let's see. So there you have it. It went on like magic. For $16, um, I think this is a fun palette. I do think it is worth the money. Um, that being said, some of these colors are not colors I would normally use and I don't foresee myself using often, particularly the light blues. Um, just not something that I, I tend to stick towards browns. and um, The you will see this in some of the palettes that we'll be talking about later. I find certain colors to be hard to blend. Um, you can even see that over here. I had some trouble with the charcoal fang color. Um, it just, you'll find that in all of these palettes. But for $16, it is fun and a complete novelty. The lip gloss, I'm wearing platform uh, 9 and 3 quarters. It is like a rose gold color. Um, it is exactly what you would expect for a $10 lip gloss. Um, some of you say that it's sticky and smells bad. I mean, it is sticky. Um, the smell is not overly um, disgusting. In fact, I think it's more of a fragrant smell. So I think that is, you know, to each his own. And then as far as the brushes go, that actually might be, you know, uh, an unsuspecting win in all of this because they're great brushes. They're really fun. They all have names that go along with the series and look at that. It's like magic. Magic magic. So I guess this is my magic wand. I will see you next time. We're going to be doing Gryffindor and leave your comments in the comment section below. Leave your uh, thoughts as to which house I am and I will tell you in the next video or two. See you then. Have a good day. Thank you.